New rules may be coming for those popular scooters you see just about everywhere downtown. The mayor is now proposing new regulations. Thanks for staying with us at 530. I'm Katie Farrell. I'm Mark Taylor. So what does this mean for riders, drivers and pedestrians? NBC 4 is Elise Changeri has the answer. The mayor just announced today that on Tuesday he's going to place emergency regulations on these scooters where you are no longer allowed to ride them on the sidewalks. You're now encouraged to ride them right on the street. The scooters are just a big, huge nuisance. Those little scooters just don't move out of the way. So you just got to kind of maneuver around a little bit to get around them and it just be like, ah! Today, Mayor Ginther says it's the city's responsibility to protect everyone sharing the road with bikes, e-bikes, and scooters. We have been working hard for the last several weeks to put in place common sense guidelines. We are excited about the expanding options to navigate our great city. This is why he is presenting Columbus City Council with per proposed legislation by the end of the week. It addresses issues including where mobility devices can be operated, keeping them on the roadway and not on sidewalks. The people are just parking them wherever they want in front of the handicapped sidewalks. I think they're a little annoying. Mayor Ginther says until this point, the city codes have not been clear on where scooters can operate. This proposed legislation clarifies this issue and makes it safer for scooter operators, pedestrians, and drivers, adding the safety precautions riders must take. Yielding to pedestrians, navigating traffic and bike lanes, and following current traffic regulations. Once the legislation goes through, that means riders would be ticketed if riding on sidewalks. Right now, riders can be ticketed for reckless driving. The people that's on those little scooters get little tickets and stuff, then they realize they have to follow the rules like everyone else. After speaking with city council, they tell me there will be an open public forum on the week of the 17th where they encourage you to come out and voice your concerns. Local for you in Columbus, Elise Chingari, NBC4.